into the show. We're heading into the 814. We've got Jason Moran here, who's the vice president for enrollment over at Juniata College, coming off a nice winning streak with your volleyball team. Yeah, no, we are we are proud, and uh, we are going for that three-peat national championship. So. Yeah, so the girls are off to Virginia for the next round. Yep, off yeah. they go. Yeah. Really exciting stuff, too, just talking about your college overall. Obviously, the planning component that goes in, things to be keeping in mind as far as uh, consideration that, you know, kids might want to go, but parents, too. Some of the, the myths they think, obviously, college, the process of enrolling and taking on all of that responsibility is a little daunting. Yeah, it can be. And the great thing is the variety of resources that are out there that can help provide parents and even uh, high school, college going students uh, with roadmaps. Mm -hmm. um, first of all, the, the internet is actually very helpful. If a parent or an advocate or a family member would just simply do a Google search that uh, word type, um, how to advise my child in um, their college search. Uh, a roadmap on timing, uh, questions to ask, mm -hmm. things to consider, it's out there. Um, what we, my team and I, what we invite our families to do too is uh, not only come with questions, but one of the most powerful questions that actually I can do a lot with, my team can do a lot with, is if a parent actually says, I don't actually know what to ask yeah. or how to approach this. Um, that's incredibly powerful because we can take that information and lay out a step-by-step -step process, uh, when to visit, types of questions to ask uh, as it pertains to um, the application process, mm -hmm. applying for financial aid. And so, again, a lot of resources that are out there. And so with that, um, I, I think having the opportunity to connect with us, engage with us, that's where the college visit is just so, so powerful. And you mentioned myths. And I think for many families out there, they'll look at a direct cost of attendance, but right. that does not mean that that is the cost you're going to be affording mm -hmm. to, for your child uh, to attend a college or university. Yeah, it's the thing too, because parents obviously, you know, maybe it's been a long time since they've had to think about these sure. things or, you know, kids really don't know where to start with this either. And I think you could learn a lot of things that you don't even know mm -hmm. with that initial assessment uh, coming out to the college. That's what the tours are all about. You guys yep. are equipped to answer those questions. Yep. And yeah, don't get the sticker shock because there are ways to kind of, you know, get that price down and, and work with families. Yeah, in many cases, it begins with a parent, a family member, an advocate asking that college-going student what their likes are, uh, what programs might they be interested in. And in this case, I mean, parents tend to know their child better than the child may know themselves. Mm -hmm. And uh, a, a real good approach to take is no different than a parent who's teaching their child how to drive, yeah. okay? The child's going to be in the driver's seat. Let their child be in the driver's seat of their college search. But also, similar to driving a car, that parent's in the passenger seat providing guidance, advice, tips along the way. And so, in many cases, it's just for Central Pennsylvania families, take advantage of the schools that are around here. Uh, come and visit us at Juniata. Mm -hmm. and my team of admissions officers, our financial aid planning team, uh, will meet with families and we will lay out that roadmap and again also provide the guidance and timing of when to engage in certain um, uh, opportunities uh, that can help educate and further inform uh, that family about the college that they're looking at. Yeah, well, it's a big commitment, a big step yeah. for, you know, a kid to take in their lives. And so you want to make sure that the program's a good fit for you. And you guys mm -hmm. have really expanded a lot of the different offerings yeah. that you have. We have some different... Um, programs on the screen here that you mm -hmm. guys are offering now. Tell us about that. Absolutely. So uh, we are, uh, by mission, we are a liberal arts college. Mm -hmm. And as a liberal arts college, uh, that provides our students and families with the opportunity uh, to uh, explore us. And students will receive an education that is broad-based, OK? They'll come pursuing a specific degree program, but they'll take a variety of courses in the arts, the humanities, uh, the natural sciences, social sciences, uh, math, perhaps computer science, information technology, while pursuing a degree. Mm -hmm. um, over the past two years, we've leaned heavier into the health sciences and also uh, engineering as well. Uh, first with engineering, uh, Junietta has long had a physics and engineering 3 plus 2 uh, program. And so building off of that, uh, we just introduced two years ago an environmental science program, or I'm sorry, an environmental engineering program mm -hmm. that builds off of our environmental sciences, a civil engineering program. And then uh, furthermore, we offer now a graduate degree program 
in the uh, ecology natural resource management arena. Uh, and then in the health sciences, uh, Juniata has long had a very strong reputation uh, for students who pursue Juniata as health professions, maybe thinking about medical school, optometry, mm -hmm. dentistry. And so with that, we built off of that foundation and two years ago launched an exercise science kinesiology degree program and then uh, also a uh, new master's program in public health, uh, a bachelor's program in public health. And then uh, we're also, this year, we are exploring nursing. Um, okay. And there's been some recent news yeah. about Juniata exploring nursing. Uh, we're doing some uh, redevelopment of uh, property that we own, uh, some grant funding, philanthropic dollars that uh, are coming in that are gonna support that space once approved by the um, uh, Pennsylvania Board of Nursing. That's fabulous yeah. and a beautiful campus. Sounds like a great education yeah. just all around. We've got some details there on your screen mm -hmm. if you want to reach out to Junior at a college. Take that initial step. If you got the questions, just like Jason said, call them up, ask them. You guys are prepared for these questions, I'm sure, with sure. All, the, all the things parents want to know. Jason, thank you so much. Great to be here. Thank you. Yeah, we appreciate it.